Anybody wants to be an all-star, I'm not going to say I, I wouldn't have wanted to be one, but you know, I'm, I'm perfectly fine with those guys that made it in. All those guys that made it definitely deserved it. Uh, I'm just looking forward to going out there and playing in a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a Rising Stars Challenge, have a little fun, and get some rest. You know, that's, that's what I'm really focusing on this year. The schedule's kind of crazy, so you know, after that game, I just want to focus on getting a little rest. It's all about winning, and I think, you know, when you look at it, it was Greg individually deserving of being an all-star without a doubt, but at the same time, all coaches, we all look at achievement, and when it's close, Close, you're going to go with the guy who's with you know has a better record. I'm very happy for Roy. You know Roy worked hard. You know I saw him a lot during the summertime. Work with him, um, so I, I understand you know the transformation he's going through. I saw him put in the work for it. I'm very proud of him. Um, uh, pretty sure he's going to have a lot of fun. Um, he's a pretty humble guy. I'm pretty sure he, he's not taking this for granted. So um, I'm very happy for him. When you're one of the better players on your team, your pride isn't your numbers. Your pride is the left-hand column. How many wins you can bring to your team?